positive psychology has been set up by Martin Seligman um, as a response to its conclusion that most of um, psychology, especially if you look around the year 2000 when it was founded, um, I think they did some study that said that about 98% of the studies in psychology is about all the ways people can be broken and how to fix them. And it's really predicated on the disease model, like what are all the diseases you can have. But then Seligman said, well, the interesting thing is that there are people who are not broken, according to the definition of psychology, but they're not happy either. And we've got people who are broken on seven different scales and they're happy as heck. So <laughs> somehow these two don't relate. And why is nobody researching how to be happier and how to function better? Let's make that our goal. So he actually did that. He set up the field of positive psychology, um, applied positive psychology actually to be able to do something with it. Uh, very interesting field. Um, Martin Seligman is the one who set it up. I can highly recommend for instance his TED talk uh, where he um, explains that. And he's also looked at for instance things like optimism and pessimism.